Hi kids, today I'm going to be unboxing two of the Target beauty boxes. I have the October one and the January one. So let's see what we got. I don't normally get the um, Target boxes, so I haven't gotten them in two years. So I, I'm kind of interested. I did peel off all the cellophane. But I have not looked inside. So let's start with the October box. Okay, it has, ooh, it smells like apples. Okay, it has this little card with like $3 off when you buy $15 beauty purchases. I remember they used to always give these um, coupons away. I don't have a Target near me. So... I never use this. I really like these boxes. Though. I like to use them for stuff. I don't think I have any more of those left. I mean, I used to use them like in my drawers and stuff like that. But like I said, it's been a while since I've gotten a Target Beauty box. So I'm anxious to see what is inside. Oh, no, oh, apples. It just smells like apples. I'm kind of wondering if it isn't the shampoo. There is a shampoo and conditioner it's a shampoo and conditioner this is a pretty good size they're three ounces each it's head and shoulders dandruff a moisture renewal conditioner and moisture boost shampoo both with coconut oil which it says paraben and dye free rich lather I don't have dandruff, but I'll try the shampoo. I mean, if it's moisturizing, hey, I'm all about moisturizing. Today I'm filming my hair still a little bit damp, which is really weird because usually my hair dries so fast, so immediate, because I don't really have very much hair left, and it's just very fine and thin and... um. So, I don't know what's going on with my hair today. I guess maybe it's the humidity or something. Whatever. Anyways, um, yeah, I'll try this. Let's see if this is what I am smelling. Oh, that smells good. It does. It kind of smells like apples. Maybe it's just me. I mean, it says it has coconut oil in it. I don't know. And then there is a Crest 3D White uh, toothpaste. I probably will not be able to use this. Oh, let's see what we have here. Um, it's a moisturizer for all skin types. Finland Lumine Lumine. Uh, I uh, Intense Hydration 24-Hour Moisturizer. I have never heard of this, so I will give it a shot. See what's up. Uh, Ardell Faux Mink Lashes. I do not use lashes, so I will pass that on. Uh, Vaseline in Extremely Dry Skin Rescue. Clinical care with barrier repair complex healing moisture lotion sure there's one ounce in here I can use one ounce of moisturizer just about any time especially right now it's really cold oh here's something tiny ooh it's a number seven line correcting booster serum you know I got lines so I'll be using this And we have things in here. Oh, we have, oh, it's hair makeup. Raspberry hair makeup to put streaks in your hair or something. I will be using this. And this one is, uh, it's like a little foil pack on the back. This one is raspberry and this one is hot pink. I, it says only for blonde to, to dark blonde for this 
pink one. So I don't know. Maybe I could dye my grays. <laughs> this one says for light brown to dark brown. This is probably one that I'll use more. I wish there was a blue one in here. I've always wanted to do blue hair. And I think that's the only color I haven't done. I've done all these pinks and raspberries and magentas and black and white and brown and reds and accidental green. Uh, I'd like to do blue. I'm trying to think, have I ever done blue? Not like a dark blue. I've never done a dark blue, which is like, I really want to try. I doubt I'll get around to trying it because my hair is so, um, it, it, it's, I don't want to talk about it. Okay, so this box was $7. Is it worth $7 for some hair makeup play stuff? It says um, you'll need a towel to protect your clothing and a brush or a comb, optional hair dryer or styling tools, which I never put heat on my hair, so we won't be needing that. And then it says you put it in with your fingertips. Uh, Brush it in, let hair dry, and style. Wash any remaining products from hand. The one day color. If it works, I may be trying a dark blue. One day color. That's a good idea, because sometimes you don't want to commit to even, like, a week, you know? It's like, sometimes I just want something fun today. Okay, so we have the colors, the two shampoos, the lime serum, the moisturizer for your face, moisturizer for your body. Yeah, that's worth $7. I probably won't be able to use the toothpaste, and I will not use the lashes. Okay. Next, we have January, and I assume this is this January, not last January. I know that they're selling a lot of old boxes on there, but I don't think they're selling them all the way back that far. Okay, we have another card. On the back, it says what your products are, and it has $3 off when you buy $15. Yeah, $15 or more in beauty products. This has dark blue. Very cute. I, I kind of like the cosmic thing. Kind of not. I don't know. Kind of reminds me of um, bad hippie days. I, I was raised in the 70s around bad hippie days. You know, people think that Oh, the hippies ended at the end of the 60s. No, hippies went on. The 70s really didn't start till the late 70s. It's a whole thing. Okay, so we have some more conditioner and shampoo. This is hair food. Why is this one all taped up and this one isn't? Okay. Are you being leaky? Okay, sulfate-free, dye-free, paraben-free, mineral oil-free. You know what? I am not into all these blah, 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 free, 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 free. Okay, the sulfate thing maybe. But, um, yeah, I'm, I'm okay with mineral oil. I know a lot of people are sensitive to it. Um, I'm pretty okay with dyes. And paraben-free, that whole thing, I don't know if I believe in that paraben thing. Um, anyways, it's three ounces each, so these are good sizes as well, and they're nourishing, nourishing, coconut milk and chai spice. That sounds good. It smells. I'm trying to get a good smell here. Oh, that does smell really good. That smells like um, coconut dessert or something. You know, it smells good. 
Next we have Retinol 24 Hour 24 Hour Hydration. This is from Olay. Oh, here. Olay Regenerous Retinol 24 Hour Night Moisturizer. And it says there's a $3 coupon inside. I am really nervous about retinol, but I think I figured out how to use retinol where I don't get the retinol burn. Sometimes it can really hurt. But being that it's Olay Drugstore, I doubt that this has enough to actually cause a retinol burn. But I'll try it and I'll use it. How much is in here? Five grams. Five grams. So this is like the tiniest little jar. Yes, it is. It is one of those little itty bitty tiny. It isn't even a full jar. It has a hole around it. It's, I think that's a little deceptive though. It's like, here's this big old box. Here's this little tiny itty bitty thing. Whatever. We have another Olay product. It is the Olay Regenerist Whip. Light as air finish active moisturizer. This is also a little tiny itty bitty jar. Look at that. Tiny little jar. That's a lot of air. Oh, yeah. yeah, you can see that where it's like, there's, n it's, not only is it a little tiny jar, but it's false advertising because it isn't even as big as the little tiny jar. And this also has a coupon inside. Uh, we have some number seven booster serum. Firming booster serum this time. I could use some firming, that's for sure. Okay, we have a foil pack of... Oh, this is for your edges. Perfect edges. This is um, cream of nature for your edges. I don't have edges, but I don't know. Maybe we could reappropriate this for something else. So, maybe. Uh, we have Crest 3D White Radiant Mint. I probably won't be able to use this again like the other one. We have some foil packs here. This is, ooh, this is K Bella Bath and Beauty. This is a watermelon peel off mask. I'm real leery of peel off masks. And this is an avocado clay mask, which I'm real leery about clay masks. But we'll see. Ooh, that feels so weird in there. I mean, it feels like thick clay. Uh, so, anyways, we'll see about using these. So, for $7, there are little tiny Olays. There's a really tiny um, number seven firming serum. Which, at least, you know, this is three mils, and they have the guts to say, oh, this is how small it is. Unlike Olay, who's like, oh, I give you five mils in a giant box. What? Anyways. And then we got the two shampoos. So two shampoos, some skincare. Seven dollars? Yeah, sure. I'll pay seven dollars for that. Uh, we have some masks, which I may or may not use and or like. And we have um, it, uh, argon oil for your edges, which I may or may not be able to reappropriate for something else since I don't have edges. I don't even have hair. And toothpaste, which I probably won't be able to use. But... I would say these boxes were worth it. They were $7 each. The tax was $116, so that would make the total $15.16. $15 worth? Yeah, sure. You know why? Because I like getting samples of things because that way I can try things out and know whether or not I want to buy a full size or just try things out just to try something new, even if I'm not looking to buy the full size, just to 
try things out. So I would find this haul, haul worth it because I'm going to get to try quite a few products. So if you like my video, hit like. If you want to subscribe and see more of me and my radiant personality, hit subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye!